Did you know that the bladder isn't sterile? This 2012 study set out to answer a big question. Is the adult female bladder really sterile? Surgeons recruited women without UTI symptoms who were scheduled for urogynecologic surgery, comparing them to a control group undergoing gynecologic surgery, and they collected urine in three ways. Voided, also known as clean catch, catheterized, known as TUC, and suprapubic aspirate, SPA, which is when you directly take urine from the bladder using a needle. They analyzed these samples using both traditional urine culture and importantly, sensitive DNA sequencing. They used 16S ribosomal RNA gene sequencing to detect bacteria and even those that we can't detect on a standard urine culture. Many women, despite no UTI symptoms, had detectable bacteria in their bladders. Catheter and aspirate samples showed similar bacteria profiles, distinct from the vaginal or skin bacteria, confirming that they were from the bladder. About half of the women had diverse bacterial communities, including species like Aerococcus and Actinobaculum, which don't usually grow on standard urine cultures. Even when cultures were negative, DNA tests still detected bacteria. Overall, this paper was a landmark moment. It completely changed how we think about urinary health and highlighted the limitations of the tests we've relied on for decades to detect UTI. If you like this no-nonsense breakdown of papers, follow us for all things UTI and pelvic health.